happening now. All right, welcome to Advocacy and Outreach SIG meeting. It's the 17th of June. Let's take a look at the uh, agenda proposal today. So Contributor Summit is the hot topic and then news and information about communication. So Jackie, anything else you need to put on the agenda? No, I think it was just the two items of the invitation email so that we can deliver the Zoom link to all registrants. Right. Um, and, so, and then also, I was going to follow up with swag. Great. Okay. So, invitation email. Here's the current body text as proposed. I've sent the request to the governing board. Oleg has reviewed it, hasn't given his approval yet, but he did propose a change. I accepted the change and I had discussed it with others on the board. My goal is to finalize for sending tomorrow. Is that workable for you? Or is that too late? Do you need it sooner than that? that that's totally fine. Um, I've already shared this document. No, but Mark. Sorry, your audio is breaking up. One sec. Uh, let me. So this is this document. This invitation email is based on the mail that the email draft you provided. Relatively minor tweaks. Hello. Hi. Can you hear me, Mark? I can, yes. Sorry, my internet's bad. I, okay, sorry, I had bad internet. Um, so, okay, now that you hear me. So, okay, I've shared this cop, this document, the invitation email with Rachel from the Linux Foundation events team. Um, so as soon as we give her the go ahead, she will build the email um, and then, she uh, said that it's easy to just email everybody that is registered for the Jenkins Contributor Summit. Um, so we just basically just need to tell her when the copy is final. Um, I told her that our goal was to send this by like either Monday or Tuesday of next week. Um, yeah, so if we can get approval uh, by Friday, that would be ideal because it gives them at least sometime to you know we got to queue it up because they support several other events as well so okay great yeah um another update i wanted to give you mark um was also <laughs> we have almost 1200 people registered for the jenkins contributor summit by the way wow I didn't close the, the, the registration because I was just like, well, like I want to see how many people attend <laughs> also because it's easy for to just register, but then not attend. So, um, yeah, uh, let's see, I, I am curious to see what that attendance rate will be. That's wonderful. So you had a, a dramatic increase. The last number I'd heard about two weeks ago was like 700. So we've, we've very nearly doubled registration in the last 10 days or so. Well, yeah, so I, I we did a few large email sends um, to, uh, we took the Linux Foundation training and we, uh, we were looking for anybody who was like part of DevOps uh, training certifications and also the Jenkins courses. And then we sent them targeted like communications about CDCon and, and so that's how we got that big registration bump. Great, thank you. Yeah, absolutely. So um, yeah, the other, the other part was swag. So we've, like I said, uh, I, we just don't have right now the budget to do, to send 1200 pieces of swag. 
to people because shipping is outrageous. Mm -hmm. Right. And so this would, like last time we did this, this incurred in shipping alone, because that's what we said we would take care of, like thousands of dollars. Mm -hmm. So that's also why we're like, okay, we can't support it. Um, um, I had proposed to find sponsors. I think it's too late for that. Um, but I think that's something for in the future. I think we will need to look for sponsorships for, for swag. Right. Uh, we, I mean, we might also choose to deliver only to selected individuals based on participation. That that also is something maybe that speakers. You, that, yes. Yeah, maybe we just do speakers or um, you know, we could do something like the first 50 people that signed up to be part of the contributor summit, or we do a raffle. Um, but I think it has to be, you know, like, like I said, we, we just can't take on the cost, right? Let's the foundation can't take on the cost of shipping right now. It's right. just not in our budget. That's that makes perfect sense. Okay, good. So next steps feels like then from from the organizing side from the Jenkins project side, decide how to handle um, how to how to so select a subset to receive swag or decide not to deliver swag with the contributors. Yeah. Side. Um, yeah. Right. Yeah. Okay. Thank you very much. Anything else from you, Jackie? Um, I, that's it from my side. I think, uh, yeah, I think, uh, I, have you guys published the agenda yet? With the, the agenda is, Olivier's got it near final and we should have it ready within the next, I'm assuming okay. the next day or so. He's been working through all the various speakers and presenters trying to get all the I's dotted okay, cool. and T's crossed. Um, how are you announcing it? So we'll send a announcement plan right now. The plan was uh, what Oleg had initially described as we would do a blog post. Oh, okay, okay. Blog post um, or other or other form of social media announcement. Blog, blog post plus social think, media. Other when forms. do you think you'll have that? In, we'll finalized. So sh I, I assume we'll be ready with it tomorrow. Oh, okay. Because then we should add that to the invitation email. Yeah, so I hesitated to put it in the invitation email because it will be, it's a very long agenda, right? It's got lots of speakers on it, uh -huh. lots of topics. And my thought was just get them to the, get them to the link very quickly in the short email and then uh, then they'll come and they, we can tell them the agenda as they arrive, or we can point them to the blog post separately. Okay. Um, so you don't want like a, a separate link that says uh, like link to the agenda. Oh, that, that might be, let, let me see about that. So that's when I can. Not actually if, include the agenda, just include right, just a the link, link to, to the, the blog. agenda. Good, good suggestion. Yeah. Let me take that. Let's take that. So it's like, here's your registration link, and then here's the blog to the full agenda. And then right. if they want to, if they want to click it, great. If they don't, then, you know, just, just the most important part is of the Zoom. Very good. Good suggestion. So let me, let me get that put onto the, that's on my action item. Great. Okay. Cool. All right. Awesome. Okay, hey, I think that covered it. Anything else, Jackie? That is it on my side. Okay, thank you for your time. Thanks very, very much. Yeah, thank you, Mark. Let you drop off to your next meeting. Thank you. Awesome. Yeah, and just ping me if you need anything else. Great, thank you. Okay, all right, and bye. Aditya, thanks for joining. Uh, would you right. have some, some additional time that you and I could go through together on other preparations for Contributor Summit and other topics? Yeah, definitely. Um, yeah. Super. Thank you. All right. So we've got, 
we've got the contributor. Are you interested in being involved in the contributor summit and in assisting with it? Yeah, if I can. Now it's the timing is centered around US East Coast start of day to end of day. So that makes it rather difficult. I assume you're based in yeah. probably ISD. based in Asia. Yeah, you're yes, ISD yes. based. Okay. So let's take a look at this and see if there are topics that are particularly of interest to you. So here's the initial schedule draft that Olivier has been working on. Okay, so mm -hmm. the things that the things where where I think we would really benefit from help from you or someone like you would be if you'd be willing to assist in one or more of the contributor tracks in being involved in discussions and offering help. We may even need assistance there just being being a voice. So are there any of these tracks, for instance, Java 11 or uh, outreach programs or contributing to Jenkins where you say, hey, I'd like to be involved in that. Yeah, if contributing to Jenkins an outreach program uh, or something, I think I can help them. Uh, but I've just started contributing to Jenkins. So uh, I, mean, I am not sure how much of a help will I be. Well, so for me, at least, it would be great to have additional people if you're willing to assist me in the contributing to Jenkins piece, I've got one or two other um, people from IST time zone as well that are interested. I would love to have multiple voices there. I would love to have us, you and me and possibly others doing a question and answer kind of experience about, hey, how do you help here? And how, what do you do there? Because you've, you've been able to join infrastructure meetings, you've joined advocacy and outreach sessions. And I think that's some good insight that you may be able to share about, hey, yeah, look, just being becoming a more active participant can help. So if you'd be willing to join me on the contributing to Jenkins session, I'll plan on it and we'll all assemble some slides and we'll talk about it together. That sounds great. Okay, good. Uh, so I'm gonna put that then as a plan here. Okay, so, all right, so contributing to Jenkins track at the Contributor Summit. All right, so Aditya Srivastava, uh, willing to assist, uh, Mark to assemble Initial slides. Uh, prepare to present with Aditya and uh, Dheeraj jo Singh Joda. Oh, Dheeraj, he he's my classmate. <laughs> oh, he is. All right. Good. Yes. Uh, so Dheeraj has been Dheeraj has been involved in documentation. Okay. And has expressed interest in, uh, in his case, in React JS. Um, and so, if there's a specific area for you, I think you would express your interest in infrastructure and in advocacy. Yes. Great. Okay. So, yeah. So, Diraj, for instance, has created the last two or three. Jenkins change logs for the weekly releases and done very well. And, and so those, those are great kinds of things for us to highlight and say, look, this is what it takes to, to do this. You join, join this group and they coach you along. Excellent, okay, very good. So, so we'll plan for you to join with that and look forward to it. Now, I, I, again, I apologize. It is nine o'clock a.m. Eastern time. Eastern US time, which is, let's see, that means it's seven. So it's about 7 p.m., 7.30 p.m. your time, Saturday morning or Saturday, let's see, Saturday, mm -hmm. is that right? No, it's 7.30 a.m. your time, Saturday. No, 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 it's p.m. No, yep, okay. I think. So, I think it's really Friday, right? 
Uh, uh, is it is fun, it still Friday? Fun. Oh yes, it may. You're right. It may because you, my time it will be. If I look at my calendar, my time it will be. Oh, uh, here we'll do it this way. Yes, I think you're right. It will be late Friday evening for you. So so you'll be. We may keep you up until eleven thirty or twelve at night, but. I, I would very much appreciate it if you're available and if you could stand to be involved. So it will start at, yeah, at about 7.30 or 8.30 p.m. your time and go for about 40 minutes. So hopefully that's not too terribly late for you on a Friday night. No, no, it's not. Okay, great. Well, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you for that. My pleasure. I, I love to work. Well, that's great. Thank you very much. Okay. And then then the other, if you're in, are you, is there any chance I could enlist your help with the Java 11 discussions just as a participant there? So, but actually, the thing is that I'm, uh, Java is not my primary language of ah. development. Okay. So I I like to stay a little bit away from the in depth of it. I am okay. more of a Python person, okay. just because my interest in machine learning and deep learning. So that is uh, something that uh, I don't think Java 11 to 17 discussion would uh, some like you won't be able to get a lot of help from me, but I would definitely learn a lot. No, if that's thank you for being willing to express where you're interested and where you're not. Let's not put you into the Java 11 when if your focus is on Python and machine learning, let's let other people work on the Java 11 thing. That's that's perfectly fine. That's absolutely great. So would you be interested in being part of, let's see, I think, oh no, I am I, let's see, have I got you? Yeah, we could consider having you join a segment on outreach. Certainly you've, you've done, done good things for us here in terms of infrastructure and advocacy. Would you like to be part of, it wouldn't be presenting, this would just be participating with Oleg in the outreach program segment. So um, like for instance, what would be my role there? Um, you would just join to help help as Oleg asks questions or as Oleg looks for ways that we might do better outreach, what you could do is share your experiences as a student in, in the IST time zone, what it means for you to try to be involved with Jenkins and what are some of the complications involved in your being involved with Jenkins. So as a, as a student, there are a certain set of complications. And as a person who's in, in IST time zone, there's a different set of complications. And, and you, right. you would be a voice there to just share your experiences, not that you'd be presenting, not that you'd be leading or driving. It's just, oh yeah, here are some things we should sh be sure we consider. Yeah, it can definitely help there. Okay, great, all right. Good, very good, okay. Excellent, all right. Anything else that comes to your mind as you look at the Contributor Summit opportunities? Are we talking about the GSOF projects and all the other uh, programs that Jen can take, Jen can take part in? Like she code Africa, you can see. And those are, those like are that. good examples of outreach programs. Yes, those are very, very good examples of outreach programs. Okay, oh, now I see it's written in the remarks section. Sorry, I missed that. 
Oh, no, no, that good for you for asking. That's great. Yeah, we have we have several, for instance, this open source design item that's listed right here is one where we think what we would like to do is involve um, a, a community that's that does web design and does artwork kinds of things and see if we can enlist their help on projects with the Jenkins project. Likewise, that last one, okay. the inclusive naming initiative is an effort by a broad group of open source projects trying to adjust their terminology to be more inclusive, to be more welcoming, to be more friendly to new people arriving. Yeah, so those, are, those are exactly outreach. Yeah. Okay. Great. All right. So let's let's go ahead then. I think we are you and I are set there. We'll plan for I'll send you a link to the initial slides and now there is a session that that if you would be available, we'll discuss the slides in Doc's office hours, Tuesday morning, I believe it's 7.30 a.m. IST. Mm, yeah. If that, would that work for you to join us for that conversation? So it's, uh, it's 22nd, right? On 22nd uh, June. I Yes, yes, 22nd June, that's correct. Yes. Okay. And yeah, if, you can, if you can't be there, that's okay. I certainly understand. That is a very early hour. That, that is and uh, that is a very early hour. My concern is actually the fact that I was about to travel in that time, so I I am not very sure whether I'll be available or not. So twenty second, twenty okay. third, that uh, those two days. Well, and, and if you're not if, available, if that's okay. Mm -hmm. We can do it. We can do it asynchronously as well. Yep. Asynchronously definitely works. Asynchronous communication. And uh, if it is possible for you, like if you are available, then you can have it sometime before that. Great. All right. Excellent. Okay, very good. So, and Aditya, you indicated your in interests are in Python and machine learning. And I'll double check with Diraj. I know he's been willing to do and has already worked on documentation and he asked a question about React last time. So those are both great topics. All right. Okay, those topics. So anything else on Contributor Summit before we go on to our next topic? No, I don't think. Okay, so we've got, just for your info, you probably ought to join community.jenkins.io. This is the new experiment in communication channels. And so for example, there are categories and uh, different ways of seeing announcements in this communication mechanism. And we'll be highlighting this to lots of people in many different ways to show them, hey, here's this, here's this, here's this. Okay. I'll join. And advocacy and outreach actually has its own its own category now and there it is amazing all right then we've got a new ebook that just was issued by Alyssa Tong on Jenkins is the way with the latest set of user stories and we're delighted with outreach wow. program proceeding I should read Wonderful. It. As a GSOC student, I'd like to add that I just submitted my first 
code contribution PR uh, as uh, you know as a part of GSOC today. <laughs> Very good. Okay. So now, which project are you on, Aditya? Co conventional commits plugin. So nice. adding new yes. <laughs> feels great. <laughs> Congratulations. And that's being mentored by Gareth Evans? Yes. Gareth, Olivier, Kristen, all his mentors. Excellent. Congratulations. That's that's very good. That's wonderful to hear. I look forward to that Thank one you, because sir. I have a personal a personal need for conventional commits. Uh, Gareth and I did did some experimenting, and I'm I'm looking forward to using your plugin. That's really great. That's motivating for me. <laughs> All right, thank you. Anything else we need to discuss today? Uh, no, I'm afraid not. All right, thank you. Let's go ahead and call this an end. Thank you, Aditya, and I'll send a link to the slides, and we'll start discussing them. Thank you. Looking forward to working on it together. Thanks. We'll see you. Bye-bye.